It's currently 3.32 a.m. Leaving in like half an hour for Yosemite. My preferred, my preferred travel aesthetic is actually Dust Pirate. So. But I would just like to give a shout out to Jack Moriarty and Will Ball for hosting us and being awesome in general. You guys rock. Ooh, it's nice and cool out here. Um, it looks like, it looks like Andrew is not awake yet, so that's fine, I'll just <sighs> mm, chill out here, wait until he gets up. Oh, hey. hey, good morning. We out. thousand feet elevation now so it's nice and cool outside which is really refreshing and the sky is just starting to get that kind of gold goldish pink color so that's really nice also wow <laughs> Yosemite. That's wow. pretty dang cool. So after waiting for almost three hours to get a spot at camp four we finally got it got my little hammock tag right there and now we're just gonna move our stuff over there and get something to eat because we're both starving and then we're just gonna go and explore around it should be super cool i'm really excited so set up camp right back there now we're going to get food Finally. All right, I changed clothes really quickly because it got really hot out and I don't want to wear long sleeves and leggings. And then I packed up. Uh, and now we're finally going to get food. It's like, what time is it? It's a little after 10.30. We've been up since three in the morning. Oh, he's on the move. Oh man, coming right here. That's the view casually just like giant boulders there's some more over there Yosemite is awesome definitely expecting the food here to be like really expensive but it's like normal food price this was only 550 but Apple was 80 cents like it's not bad we call it too how's it taste pretty I give it like a seven and a half nice so we're just walking back to our campsite and we come around a corner and there's just like that. Literally just like 
casual. What the heck? <laughs> My mind is blown. Wow. We're driving to El Cap Meadows right now. We're just gonna see what it's like there. See if we can see any climbers doing cool rock climbing things, which would be super dope. So far, everything about Yosemite is amazing. Oh, it's one of the top three most amazing places I've ever been, probably. It's like right up there, right up there with Iceland and the Highlands of Scotland in terms of just insanity. Literal thousand foot cliffs just going straight down. It's, it's really neat. And you can just feel everyone here is just so stoked to be here. And there's so many people that are just here because they love rock climbing or they love like, Whatever it is that they're doing, there's just an energy in the air which is super tangible and super awesome and completely intoxicating and I love it! So you can't see from here but there's some climbers right up there. There they are. So that's insane. Let's see, so the climbers are right there. They look like they're about halfway up. Uh, the guy said that they're doing a 15 hour climb of it. Pretty amazing. So, Andrew's going on a hike and I got lost coming back to the camp. They also got this hat, which I'm super stoked about. I needed a hat like this for a while and I finally got one. Um, now I finally found my way back to the lodge, this place, and I'm just doing some editing, which I need to get done, and then I'm gonna head back to camp and probably just like draw and hang out because I only got three hours of sleep last night, so I'm super tired. All right, got some good work done in there. Now I'm gonna try and find the campsite again. back at the camp for a little bit, changed my shoes, and now I'm going that direction. It got shadowy over here because there's giant cliffs behind me, so I'm gonna go and try and find some sunshine. Okay, Yosemite, that's fine. Wow. That was a nice quick walk into that meadow, but Andrew just texted me saying he just got back to camp. So I'm going back there and we're gonna try and catch sunset at either Taft Point or Glacier Point or one of those places. It should be super rad. Also, Rod Trevino and Sam Griggs are coming, so I think we're gonna hopefully meet up with them today or tomorrow. Um, yeah, I'm super excited. It'll be neat. Gets me every time. Sunset doesn't set for another like two hours, so we're gonna go and get some Wi Fi. When you and your travel partner both vlog. <laughs> now, we are headed to Glacier Point to uh, 
That was definitely the most traumatizing bathroom experience of my life so far. Not bad at all. This view is the only thing that would make that bathroom experience worth it but it's a pretty spectacular view, so worth it. Now I gotta track down Andrew. He should be pretty easy to find because he's got a camera. That was a joke in case you didn't get it because everyone here has a camera or two. I feel like in situations like this, it's a lot better when people are trying to find me because I'm really tall. So, I don't know, I'm easier to find. And he's so small, so small he gets lost easily. Be right there. We're just hanging out on the edge of this little cliff thing. Hey guys. Hey, Rod. Hey. It's so nice. It's so nice, yeah, hey. Look who it is, bug. Woo! Please don't fall. You should do a handstand. Not actually though. Please don't. <laughs> Bye. Love those guys. They're, They're so, so, rad. so rad. We're going back to the valley to sleep. My beautiful hammock is waiting for me and I'm so excited. It's gonna be so comfy. So, that's the plan. Good night. <laughs>